Hello everyone, my name is Brennan and welcome to another Blender tutorial. Today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to create an audio visualizer with a picture in the middle of it. Uh, this video was requested by Doggyback. He said, I love your vids. Do you think that you can make a video on making an audio spectrum that has your own custom picture in it? So I'm going to be doing that. Um, first of all, I will load in an audio visualizer that I already created. And you can watch a uh, different tutorial that I did on how to make an audio visualizer. Um, okay, so let's just say that we are using this audio visualizer right here. I'm going to select cursor to selected. Turn on the screencast keys just so you can see what I'm doing. Try not to go too fast. Start the display of screencast keys. <coughs> okay, so now let's go ahead and load in some kind of image. We can add text if we want. We could add text. All you have to do is center the cursor, put the cursor in the center of the audio, visu audio visualizer, and then add an object. It could be anything really. You could put a plane with a texture on it in the center like that. Or you could add some text. You could add a logo, like your name. Rotate it 90 degrees. And then I'm going to move it over on the x-axis. Move it down on the z-axis. And then move it over on the x-axis again. And then I'm going to add in my name. I'll just put Bishop. And there we go. So I added my name there. So now that is a very simple way to add your name. After that, you can go to the font tab. You can customize your font. You can add in a new font just by loading it in by clicking this button right here on the regular, which is usually what I select just because I'm not, I'm not doing any kind of bold or italic, bold and italic. It could be sometimes, but I usually just use the regular um, just so that it keeps the default font. doesn't change any other options. So that's how you add something like a logo. So if you want to add your own custom picture, you could, if you want to load in an actual picture, you could just go to File, Import, and then Images as Planes. And then you could go to an image that you have. So I'm going to go to, let's see... I'm going to go to here, Let's see, textures, I'm going to get a texture like hmm, something that will work. Let's put this clock in the center, just try that out. Um, oh, and also one thing, when you're importing it, if you want it to be PNG, you have to make sure to select the options for PNG. Um, and Cycles is different from the internal render. So we have to go to Images as Planes, select our image, which is right down here somewhere. There it is, right there. So then on these settings on the left, you'll see them down in the left bottom corner. You can select Diffuse and Transparent or Emission and Transparent. And then make sure Use Alpha is on. And now we just select import images as planes or Im import image. Yeah, import image as plane. And there we go. Now it has transparency. So that's our own custom picture. It could be anything really. And then you just like, I'm just going to scale it up like that. Scale it up just a bit. And you can kind of see it coming through. It's overlapping these edges and vertices on this object. So you might want to just move it forward a little bit. And now from the camera view, it looks pretty cool. It's there looks great so that's how you put your own custom picture your own custom logo in the middle of your audio visualizer i hope that's what you wanted me to do a tutorial on uh, doggy back um, if not you can let me know in the comments below and oops um, if you thought this tutorial was great then please give it a thumbs up um, thank you guys so much for subscribing and everything it's been great i have 700 and See if I can remember. 700. <laughs> 741, I think. Or at least it was 741 subscribers. Let me check. Oh, looks like 740 subscribers. Thank you guys so much for subscribing. Um, you can check out my other channels um, whenever you like. I have a video upcoming tomorrow, actually. If I get this uploaded today, I will have one tomorrow um, on my Bishop TV channel. And yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I will see you next Tutorial Tuesday.
Happy holidays and great. Have a great day.